find some more of the Alchemist code. So, they finally added in a character, well, the two characters that have, um, that have been traveling with that other story character. I don't remember. I, I really don't care much for that, uh, part of the story. But I guess you guys will learn who I was talking about. Rebecca and somebody else. Who are they? Oh yeah, Alma and Rebecca. So yeah, those two are finally joining us. To be honest, I really didn't care about the whole care about the whole academy thing after Edgar. And that story, eh, eh I, I totally forgot most of what happened in it. <laughs> wasn't just a huge fan of it for some reason. I just couldn't get into that story as much as the others. But let's see. We got a, quite a few summons. Let me go ahead and do the free summons first. Then we're going to get into um, Rebecca's stuff. So Fang told me that Rebecca is basically the god of all free units. So she is actually worth farming up. So, that's exactly what I'm going to do after this video is just farm the hell out of her. Get as many um, shards as I can to the point where I can just completely enlighten her if she has enlightenment. Which I'm sure she probably does. And make sure my audio and everything's good. Okay. And yeah, we're good. As for my cannon, she's coming along pretty nicely too. I never recommend doing that, especially with the units that are in it. And wait, hold up. Mm -hmm. Oh, they're just steps and shit like that. Yeah, I would personally wouldn't recommend doing that myself since I'm pretty far in the game. But if you are a new player, then I would recommend doing it. It's actually pretty cheap. Uh, we're going to do a summon for Alma and see if we can get anything. That isn't a half bad uh, banner to summon on. I'm not sure about summoning for Leaf. I think I'm gonna actually dodge that one. And let's see. Nothing else that really interests me. Aw. Are all the min. Yeah, all the mementos are 250 today. Well, this week. That sucks. There go some paid ones. I'm not doing those. Alright, I guess this is the only one we're going to be doing this week. Let's see if we get anything. I don't think we did. Let's hope we get the character and not the shards. Moment of truth. Oh, looks like we only got the shards. Yep, everything else is basically useless to us. That was cool to summon on it, at least. Anyway, next. Time to... Event. I think there's only five episodes in here, so... As always, the story will be at the end of the video. Right now, we're just going to be focusing on completing all the stages. Then we'll go back and react to all the videos at the end. Of, well, to all the story at the end of it. Alright. So yeah, Cannon is almost done. She just needs one more enhance on um, Envy, and she's done. Then I'm going to move on to the second one. But I got to wait until Envy comes back because I'm, I'm missing like two more of the whole Envy statues. So yeah, that's what feels bad. I'm just going to go in here with this team. Why not? I don't think they sh these stages are going to be all that difficult, to be honest. So I could just put it on auto. Auto Queen is going to be in this one? Okay. Here it's, it's interesting to see what that's all about. So what does this stage look like? Whoops. I've actually been using cannon a lot more now. <laughs> it's funny. It took me to this end of the Sacred Stone to start working on her, you know? <laughs> I guess it's because she has an enlightenment now and she's actually farmable. 
I never really cared up until then. I do love using the Harl, but pretty soon he will be no longer one of the good units. Well, these were fires. Mostly just because uh, he's getting outclassed really fast. Since he doesn't have enlightenment. I hope they start doing like rerun events for like uh, the other collabs we've been through. Cause I would love another Final Fantasy event. Good of you. Oh, the teacher has her own stuff now. I guess we'll probably be able to use her in the future. Is what I'm guessing at least. There's also submissions to get like a free 5 star memento and a free 5 star character as well. For those of you guys who haven't like looked too much into it. So I'm going to go over here and challenges. So yeah, once you finish this, you get a five-star memento. That's pretty much leveling up and bringing up Rebecca. You can get a five-star one after you complete all the story. Five-star character. Oh yeah, this is like chapter three. Wait, hold up. Is this stuff that's already out? Okay, yeah. So you gotta go through all the chapters of chapter 1 through 3. Just to be able to get like a free 5 star character. So that's good for new players. Pretty nice. And really good rewards on here. So I would definitely recommend putting those up. Get 300 gems. Get 5 freaking... Um, what was that? Yeah, the robots that enhance your um, mementos. Perfect. And you can get a plus four summon too. Really good for starting players. But those events won't last for like ever. Okay. Uh, what were we going to do? Let me grab this. Yes, I still have that in there. I don't know who I want to use it on yet. I need to actually look at that because I only got like six more days. So basically next week that's going to expire. Because most of the ones I have are already are maxed out. Alright, episode 3. Need Rebecca. Okay, I'm go grab Rebecca then. So they're forcing us to use Rebecca already? Jeez, man. Calm down. She comes out of her memento too. 3 star Rebecca. So yeah, very recommended to farm this character since... Fang is telling me that she's the god of free units. Emperor's a pretty good way to like start starting the game right now. Um, let's see. Oh yeah, she's well, she's water, right? No, she's not. I wouldn't take her for wind. Let's just go to obtained. Oh, she's thunder. That's interesting, I guess. What stuff does she have for thunder units? Oh, it's for her um, country. Okay, so we're gonna have a, oh geez, we have three extra dungeons.
All right, we can get her to level 60. Let's go ahead and finish that. And increase our skills. Alright, her abilities actually don't look too bad. You can tell they've just been modified a little bit too. Okay, so she's a like a modified uh, unit. Okay. Yeah, okay, I can't look at her skills early. Um, okay, so she has an extra attack down here. Obviously, she's going to be a pretty decent unit. Alright. Oh yeah, we got a weapon we can get too. I saw that. Next episode. Episode 2. Not shower. Wait. Not nah, actually now that I think about it. Is she a modified unit? I've barely ever used like base spellcasters. Maybe she's not. Hold on. Oh no, she definitely is. Never mind. Wait, no. God, I don't even remember. Fuck it. <laughs> uh, I actually don't even remember. Like I said, it's been a while since I've used, like, spellcasters. Because I feel like their radius was, like, way smaller. I guess I'm kind of used to, like, the lower stuff. Okay, so what do we have to do here? What we gotta do here is no deaths, no continues, and less items used. Okay, we can do that. Seems like this is gonna be a pretty quick event, to be honest. I'm so wondering, is that a guy or a girl? Can somebody still explain that one to me? <laughs> I've been wondering that since the freaking... The actual, like, story. Pretty sure that's a female. But then again, she... Also reminds me of a guy, I guess. <laughs> Wait, are these giving out a different out? Okay, I was about to say. Kind of weird. Let me see. What are you more resistant to? Okay, just making sure you don't have like a little slight resistant thing. Okay, that's what I was thinking about. Those little, little X's right there. Yeah, I'll just finish you off with a love tap in the face. <laughs> Episode motherfucking three is done. All right, so this is pretty much like a little bit of an easier event, like new player friendly. So I'm guessing they're gonna have more of these events now. Just to introduce those new characters that come in. Because they still have the teacher, they still got the queen, stuff like that. And you're sitting here pretty one, pretty much wondering, is the queen ever going to be in the game? I don't even think she's in the Korean version, is she?
Because normally we do get all the antagonists. Normally. No mercenary, no deaths. Less items used. God, it's been a while since we've seen that dude. Yeah, no one Aaron, he would have went over there and jumped into Soul's freaking attack. Like he always does. So I end up having to control him myself. Small sacrifice, Aaron. Actually, never mind. You don't have to sacrifice anything. <laughs> She's pretty much dead. All right, all right, all right. And episode five. Okay, so it's a lock leader thing. Alright, just the same ordeal. Nothing like too difficult. Why do I feel like these are like little small summaries? Yeah, I feel like these are like little small summaries. Take out that area. Oh, you live. Okay. Pretty sure one of the NPCs will kill you. We will take out. The magic casters. They'll be annoying. Please use Martin and go kill that archer. Thank you. Thunder. Thunder. Ah, oh, why are you so close? Why are you so close, damn it? Dude, I might just let you die first because you're not my unit and my no death run still stays up even though you even though I kill you I know you're gonna try to go behind me Or try and attack him, I guess that works too. Good thing I didn't do what I thought I was gonna do. Okay, you're still in the middle of that. I could go over there and kill you, but I think you out instead. And we could just do this. I need like so many more units. Oh, I didn't even realize you jumped into it. What the hell? Why would you jump into that? That's my biggest question for you.
I just dropped something. <laughs> Alright, extra dungeons. Extra dungeons. Yep, for her staff, too. Third team only. Oh, okay, this is gonna be one of those to where you can get her memento. Over and over. I know that they've been doing this a lot since the whole, um... Attack on Titan thing. Like, they definitely changed a lot since the Attack on Titan. It's funny because that's an event that just expanded everything, <laughs> basically. Magic defense. I was hoping it was going to be magic attack, but that's fine. It's going to be a group attack, though. So you can make her really damn strong. Ha ha. Ha 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 ha. And goddammit, now I gotta go all the way back through here just to get back to the story. Alright, so now we're gonna be trying out the extra dungeons. See if we can beat those. Pretty sure we can. Oh, wait, can you farm? Uh huh. I was hoping you could farm her, but nope, you cannot. Rebecca kills the last unit. Okay. We probably can do that. Probably. Alright, Laharl. It's been good having you. You gotta be switched out now. Did they say anything about mercenaries? So I can finish this faster? Nope, they say nothing about mercenaries. Perfect. This is bringing another Aaron. Not Arendelle get me killed. Okay, I guess this Aaron is fine. We'll just use him. <sighs> ah, perfect stretch. Oh, what the fuck is this? Excuse me? I don't like stepping on those. What is this gonna do? I should have read the quest. Well, too late now. <laughs> I guess we're going to be just rolling with it. <laughs> so if I step on this, this increases my healing and overall HP. If I'm down on it... Oh, nope. That is not what that does. I don't like this. I don't like any of this. Um, sure. Let's just go on that. See what happens. Oh, does that increase my defense? Apparently that does increase my defense. But what is the... Pretty sure an attack is traps, right? Well, the red ones are, like, traps. Yeah, okay. Yep, it's still the same. <laughs> oh, no. So, I guess, see... Eh? My little units there are going to be the, um best ones for this e -he 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 -he. that's gonna be annoying <sighs> now I gotta think about this a little bit let's say can I go over there Oh no, not sleeps. No, stop sleeping. What is purple? <laughs> I'm afraid to use a unit on purple. I know I should have brought all thunder units, but fuck it. Okay, purples do what? Okay, so it has a whole bunch of bounds and crap. Actually, Roxanne would have been perfect for this. The only reason I'm not too worried about it is just because I could just do this and replace 
you with that debuff. Well, that's if you got it, but <laughs> it doesn't look like you're going to get it, which is perfect. I need to kill them. That's getting annoying. Okay, that's not even funny. I can't do anything with her. Okay, I'm gonna do this. Cannon, you have to take a little bit of HP damage. Wait, is it? Okay, I guess it really depends on how much HP your character has, I'm guessing? Physical damage. Magical damage is not going to help that though. I want to kill this Mandrake before he starts doing something too. Drastic. Wait, what? Oh, okay, so it doesn't move. So, so, doesn't she die? Yeah, I can't do anything on that. So I guess I would have to do something else. Oh, I have an idea, actually. I have an idea. That can totally fix our whole problem here. Dunda. Replace you. Well, she won't be able to do much anyway. No, I'm just going to give her one of um, the actual gears over here. I don't know. This gear seems to like to save my life a lot more than anything. <laughs> okay. Oh wow, pretty decent stats, even though he's not even maxed out. Uh, let's take another Roxanne, and we'll do this instead. So, what I want to do is ignore the units that are across from us, and take out the other units that are over on the side as fast as possible. That's at least my plan. But I also, oh crap, I forgot that item I was going to bring. I was going to bring that item that increases her move so she doesn't have to do too much on that. But the quicker reach over here now. So that should take out three. Let's finish that mission. And that kills her. I'm gonna make a little wall here. And we're gonna shoot you. Keep your HP the same. Don't do anything else. Move you. Okay. So we're gonna just do. Oh wow, I can't hit anywhere lower than that. Oh well, I'm gonna have to keep one of those lizards alive. Well, except for that crit that just went on there.
Now I gotta go get the rest of them and take them out. I know they aren't gonna move. Okay. I'm just gonna farm jewels off you. Pretty sure I can still kill him. I gotta move over one. But yeah, I'm pretty sure I can still kill this guy. Because he only has a... Uh, physical protection. Yeah, that mandrake kind of ruined a few things. aren't going to move, so we're good. Okay, I have a little bit of a better strat than what I just did there. I could kill the Mandrake leg like, really fast after I wipe out those archers. How can I not reach you? Is there a real question I should be asking? Okay, so the Mandrake, you can't take out anyway. Noted, so you would have to bring a magic caster after this point. Okay. They all are affected by special effects and shit like that, which is perfect. So Rebecca has to be the one who starts taking out things afterwards. Okay, I understand. So just in case you guys are wondering how this stage is going to work, that's pretty much one way it's going to have to do. You're going to have to bring a magic caster. There's no ifs, ands, or buts about it. You have to bring a magic caster. But the thing is, you don't have to do it for, well, yeah, you're going to have to do it for Thunder, but I recommend just doing it with a full magic team first, then going back to do it with Thunder only if you guys want, if you guys want these coins. Uh, this mission also makes it to where you don't have her inside of the sub because she has to be in the main party. So, unfortunately, nobody else... Everybody just has her for their thunder. I don't know why. So annoying. <laughs> They're going to have to add way more, like, thunder units. Because it just seems like Karis and Roxanne just completely takes it over. Alright, first things first, so we don't have to deal with her BS this whole time. I should have killed them first, then hit over there, but like I said, I don't want to keep her alive because she's going to be a huge issue. We just need to kill a lot faster. Okay, I guess that's a lot better. So we can't just sit here and waste too much time. Okay, so the deeper you go into there... So the deeper you go in here, the more damage it's going to do. So these do 1,000, these do 2,000, those might do 3,000. Oops. 
some jewels, thank you. right here oh wait I have a movement um, item actually now that I think about it all right there's that we're gonna start healing you wait a minute okay they say nothing about heals Best thing we can do right now is just CC the enemies. We'll take some of the pressure off. I can sit here and I would be able to kill him so that's gonna be our last one to kill all right, I need more CC thank you Finish him off. Let's not stand right there. If only there was a character that killed guts, you know? That'd be amazing. <laughs> Basically just completely break the rules of the game, you know? <laughs> okay. So now I should be able to reach... No, not yet. I gotta step one more. One more, one more, one more. Just a long cycle, I know. <laughs> and I still also have to go look at story and see how that is right now. There we go. I'm gonna skip Rebecca's turn just to make sure yeah, she doesn't just randomly outspeed her. We killed this thing by accident. Okay. We're good. Wait a minute. I'm sitting here, wait. This Mandrake wouldn't be the last opponent, right? I said, the man. Yeah, the Mandrake's technically the last opponent. That, does that even count? Yeah, I guess Rebecca technically killed the last one. Yeah, what the fuck? So... Yeah, that doesn't count. 
Okay. Well, screw that mission. I'm done, I'm done trying with that one. I'm lazy. <laughs> I really could care less. Let's, get, let's just go on. That made no sense. That honestly did not make any sense. Okay, this one I don't care too much about because I don't have the unit. So I'm just going to go with my regular team. And without you... If I don't have the unit, I'm not just going to stress the hell out trying to get through that. But I'm pretty sure we're going to need normal units. So where is my Noctis? Oh yeah, I still have this on that. Noctis, Noctis, Noctis. Well, let's take Ultima, actually. And then let's change this to Noctis. Who I don't think I have stuff on anymore. <laughs> going to put that on. Hmm. Huh. Yeah, let's give you your armor back, buddy. Here you go. We're gonna replace cannon. And put her in the back. We're gonna change your slot with Ultima and that's how we're just gonna do it for now actually yeah that's how we're gonna do it <laughs> full-on risky this is gonna bring a mercenary and let's bring yeah sure let's bring another envy we're not going to have the envies do much. We're just going to have the envies there just for increasing stuff. Oh, wow. Completely different map, actually. I thought we were going to still use magic units. Oh, magic tag went up for them. Jeez. Let's hope... <laughs> She's fast enough to outspeed them. Okay, yeah, we're good. <laughs> no, stop it. Dude, screw your wall. wanted to do that over there, but I guess that'll be fine if I just do double that and go to sleep for now. I'm pretty sure somebody's going to wake me up out of it later. No, I'd be fine if you kill her. I should be able to do. Nope, never mind. I can't go to her, though. Like I said, dude, the Envy Squad is really strong. It just lowers the crap out of your defense. Yeah, no, none of the crap you're we're about to do. I don't know what you're about to do, but yeah, we're gonna stop that now. Hey buddy, are you dodging once?
Go ahead and wake you up. Oh, wow. There you go. Kill you. You're the last one. <gasps> I could take your stats, can't I? Are your stats still full blown? Yeah, they got it. Oh my god, that is a lot. <laughs> Let's see if we can cut that in half for sure. So he just goes through a cycle of enemies that. of your enemy. Well, yeah, your allies that spawn. I wonder, is he, um, can you place Dizzy on him? That's what I'm mostly curious about. Whoops. Ah, Cannon, you and your fat ass are in the way. Okay, no, you can't. You can't stop him, but you can do quite a bit of damage with that. But also, can you poison him? Oh yeah, you can poison him. Just a low chance. Thanks, dude. See how much attack you got now. Oh my god! <laughs> Hold on, let's see his stats now. Oh my god, you took so much from him. Dude, see? This is why I like this character. <laughs> Now he's doing like a thousand. Whoa, Jesus. A thousand less? <laughs> oh no. God, I love this character. <laughs> no fucking way. Hold on. I might actually be in love with this character and the stat stealing. She's gonna be as strong as Ban anyway, so. Well, Ban's gonna be like way stronger. GG's. Wait, what? Oh, come on. <laughs> I guess they're like, nope. That, that's not allowed here. That's fine, because you die anyway. Oh, I should have put it on him. That's what I probably should have done. Okay, that works. <laughs> oh my god, that's actually really damn good for any unit that likes to, you know, buff the hell out. Those units are really annoying to deal with. Oh, I wish he was like level 91 for sure. Okay, so now we have a super hard one. Which is where you get her stuff. You can't get her um, shards from here. You gotta get them from here, unfortunately. Let's see. Alright, so I gotta try and auto this that is not my mission is to try and auto this that is the only thing I have in mind if like I always say if I can auto it I can just simply get the shards but most of the time they try to make it to where you can't auto stages which is like really annoying yeah I did finish her up uh, her new Valkyrie plus I haven't finished her um Crusader just because I need to find some more of those um tokens I 
gonna try this team out first. Well, let's do it with a mercenary. Do we want to bring Levi? We could bring Levi, but do we want to bring Levi? We'll probably bring Levi if this doesn't work out. How much you want to bet they countered the whole um, autoing because you have to do certain things with it? All right, for now it doesn't seem like you have to. Permanent magic increase though, so that's gonna be annoying. So magic damagers can't do much. Oh, never mind. All right, if you use that, then magic is actually available. So I'm guessing the teacher fights with you? Jesus Christ, the archer damage. I think I need to put something on my, um... Aaron. I think I know what I have in mind for my Aaron. Wow. We got how dangerous Soul is for the team. Not Aaron, no, so. Aaron just likes to get himself killed by that most of the time. <laughs> yeah, all these units are just like all over the place, man. This just makes like real big complications. But I'm pretty sure I found a way to counter that. Well, not counter it, but just to ease it. I'm pretty sure people know what I'm thinking of. It's that token that we had got one day. Okay, and these guys. So yeah, they put the Mandrake there just to get everybody to fucking not auto it. Just because your AI is going to just stick on that at one enemy. No, not that. Was this right? Nope. This. Yeah, you see how my allies are just attacking not only. So they kind of countered autoing on this stage. Which is really annoying when they do that. Like, nobody has that amount of time to just be going back to the stage, back and forth, back and forth. Now I gotta think of something different. Like, what's the point of countering auto? Especially when it includes the only place of gathering shards. <laughs> uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh yeah, Aaron. I'm just gonna take that key off of you since that's basically useless right now since I'm not actually get out of here actually I'm gonna take this off and we're gonna use where is it? this it decreases um missile attacks some of you guys have probably gotten this item some of you guys probably have not Take you out and replace you with Laharl, I guess. <laughs> We're gonna bring Levi. To be honest, I never could tell which was a good Levi by like what he carries. Maybe just because I don't have my own Levi and I can't tell it from there. Maybe. <sighs> well, good try one more time, and I'll just figure out how to auto it myself later. But 
at the moment, I think... I think I'm actually gonna do... Is... Every time I start this, I'm gonna go... I guess over here. Let's see what this does. No, not the wall. All evasion, all mystic. I'm guessing that's how they want us to do this, is what I'm guessing, at least. How much damage do you have? Oh, you have a lot of magic attack I don't want to be going out. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and strip you of that for a while. to bring. Let's see. So if I jump off this, do I lose those stats? Ah, no. Okay, so then the, that is nothing. Okay, yeah, I'm just gonna do that. Wait. I was gonna say I'm just gonna do that solo. Just later. But I'm kinda interested how much damage they actually do to Aaron now with that um missile resist on. I know which units are not usable in here. The spearmen are still gonna be an issue. I learned that Aaron really doesn't use his like HP regen either, especially when he needs to. He like completely ignores it now. I think we just need magic units on here. <laughs> I mean, that at least seems like the running thing. like the archers. Nah, fuck it. So they also have dark resist too. Alright, so Aaron's the only person who's left. Good job killing your teammate. Okay, so we can still one-shot the archers with that. That means he probably can one shot normal units too. Somewhat until the wolf did that. He's not gonna aim for her, that I do know. So he's gonna die by default. Yeah, you have to manual this. Trying to auto this is just like pure health. 
Especially since you can't kill the Mandrake and stop the buffing. And even if I were to bring um bring him with his um warrior counter, I doubt that will still do much. Nah, actually I think that would work. Considering I just changed it back just for a certain stage, because I brought a whole bunch of other units. But we're gonna I'm gonna save that one off. Or I'm gonna do like another run before I actually do that because I actually have another idea. So Liver Breaker five times. So it's basically like, yeah dude, hey, you can do this event. So they, they made it not easy to get to our stuff for sure. Unless I'm reading the events wrong. I feel like I'm reading the events wrong, but at the same time I'm not. Okay, dope. No. You can't get in there. And you can't get in here. So yeah, her, her shards are only in Extra Dungeon 3. Noted. But what are in Extra Dungeon 1? As the completes. Okay. Get a few in here. Which is actually pretty nice. And then you get her stuff too, even though you don't have her weird definitely really weird unless you can get her through the event i guess that would be nice actually do they give you enough to where you can just straight up summon her actually because that's the case i'll go back and do uh all these i think that is how you can do that so you don't have to work too hard for it i also didn't think of her as a thunder unit for some reason, I always thought she was like a light unit. Yeah, I can see how she could be like really strong, to be honest. She also has a divider, too. Yeah, definitely not half bad. I don't have enough to get her to like straight up 11, though. Now that I can get her above that anyway for our job pluses, because I would definitely have to farm this a bit. Um, what I was thinking of doing was bringing another Aaron that had the this. And seeing if we could just steamroll through that. And having units that would probably be pretty good at taking off a little bit of aggro. We're just gonna see. I, I just want to test this out once and then we're gonna get into the story. <laughs> Doing that just increased damage.
Actually, maybe I should have had one of the errands go up there, kill that little squad up there. Then maybe I would have been free. Because this Aaron does not have the regen armor. So he's going to be pretty basic out of this whole situation. So instead, I'm going to do that. I know I said that was going to be the last one, but you know, I, hey, I, I'm, I'm invested at this point. <laughs> Just because I know I have the thoughts and ideas in my head. It's just, you know, throwing them onto the field was just an issue. Oh, he probably took the armor off because he was doing like a different stage. Yeah. I can see why. Because I was wondering, like, what the hell's going on? Could have sworn this guy had, like, armor on. <laughs> but that's fine. That's fine, that's fine. We can work with that. So for you, you're going to be over here. Buff everybody. I guess it would be best to kill her first. Would that end the whole match? God, man, I'm so curious now. Yeah, hey, I just want to bring a whole fire team with this. Oh yeah, you guys don't have stuns anymore, do you? Oh no, you do. But she can't be stunned, so yeah. I figured as much. That's mostly what they do during these events. Okay, water resist. So you're basically on the time limit. gonna be able to reach them in time. That's so annoying. She's gonna try and cast it again. Yeah, this time she's gonna hit that Aaron. Yeah, bring a full fire team is best just because of the two Aaron's. Okay, then fire defense will go up. Which one's going up? Uh, you? Okay, yeah, perfect. I guess she's locked on to them too. Okay, no. Yeah, even <laughs> Vet Vettel's doing a whole bunch of damage too. So, yeah, just bringing a whole fire team would definitely be really good. Can we stop with the sleep arrows? 
Okay, I think she should be coming out of his rage next turn. Unless these archers are better. That fire boost kind of fucked us over. Yeah, it fucked us over like big time. Jesus Christ. Alright, and yeah, so I would have to go back into this. They basically countered my, um, my basic counter. Because nobody's going to actually sh straight up just normal hit. <laughs> yeah, do you ever see her normal hitting? That ain't happening. So I can't even try this strat, this strat either. Well, I might have something going on soon, but I'm pretty sure Aaron's gonna get stuck on the Mandrake again. Oh. Aw, oh, damn. If only you would have countered, that would have been perfect. Like, can you just, you know, keep normal hitting, please? Nah, she's not gonna normal hit. She's gonna blizzard or thunder, whichever one. Damn, that sucks. If he would have countered, she would have been dead. Guess I should have left his basic stuff on. But we almost had it. So yeah, no way to actually like auto this for me. So I might just farm the basic stuff and just stop her at 75 maybe. I'm not sure yet. But we'll... I'll figure out something. I'll definitely figure out something. I'll keep, I'll keep trying until like the event, you know, ends, but... I think I'll be happy with 75 when the event ends and I still don't and I still can't get like get through it. Uh, uh, let's see. Oh, duh. You would go to summons wolf. What are you thinking of? <laughs> Allergies, please don't be coming back right now. Uh, let's open this up. And grab all of our stuff. Oh, plus four memento as well. Nice, 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 nice. Let's open the plus four, then we'll open the five. You never know what can come out of a plus four. Nope, oh, it's new, so I definitely don't have it. Oh, well, it's three star. Oh, four star. Oh, that's it. that is one of the new ones, too. What is this character mostly for Fujika? I don't even use Fujika. <laughs> Epos. Well, what was I about to say? Episode 5. <laughs> Alright, so this is one of the new ones. Which one is it? I mean, I guess that's fine. I don't even have all three of them finished or anything. I don't think I'm going to be too concerned with it, but I'll figure out something. If at best, I could try to get Put it on overboard. Speaking of her, I have not even tried to fight that stage again afterwards.
I'll try to get it one day. But it's a story time. Let's go ahead and get into the story. Story replay. Events. Hey, what the hell? I was about to say. <laughs> That's not right. Wait, no, that is definitely not right. Oh, there it is. I thought it would be in order by release, but apparently not. Alright, episode one. Yeah, but you're still technically the queen. Really? You know, I was thinking Soul would probably be good for that stage, but he'll probably get slept and drained, then comboed by magic. <laughs> I forgot, was this like all female territory? Basically. Well, most of it. Now that I think about it, all the female events, all the events for like um, Lust have been mostly females. Or all female. So I think it is female territory. I don't know why I keep forgetting. But normally Michael still is there too, but... Hmm. Anyway. I mean, this is one of the reasons why I didn't really care for uh, the story of, like, the Academy after, like, Edgar's story. Because it, it wasn't, like, how do I put it? It wasn't just, like, 
all that interesting, to be honest. You know, it had its moments, but it wasn't just like as good as Edgar's or Logie's story. I mean, we also have like the one with the archer chick too, which is kind of all right ish. <laughs> And a lot, personally, I feel like it's a lot better than this, though. Personally. No, some people probably won't agree with that one, but most of the ones aren't as impactful as the first and second chapter. I think Alma is definitely my favorite, though, out of that chapter. Tell totally if we got the court mages always, for some reason, are less like enemies just as much as corpse is for um northern pride like literally every single country has like their own things to fight against i guess at the end of all of this all the bad factions are gonna just you know, team up against all the other countries. <laughs> Actually, Northern Pride's um, enemies are dead in the Sacred Stone, so. Well, no, nah, never mind. Like I said, there's still a corpse. Corpse is still going around and doing their crap. Wagi's still alive, so Northern Pride still has enemies. <laughs> Lies that just came out of this woman's mouth.
Dude, just this conversation is like really putting me to sleep. <laughs> Flying under the influence? Okay. What was she doing there? She said nothing this whole time, didn't she? Like, after a while, she just stopped completely talking. I think I missed something. Oy. I think that is a female, for sure. <laughs> Has to be. Okay, yeah, definitely female. Uh. I just I just could not tell just because the design this, this most guys were that. I I was just like a little bit confused. You know what? She didn't fight like too much in the story, right? So we didn't really get to see animations of how she like actually fall. Oh, that's for sure. <laughs> that that is true as hell. I mean throw hands catch these hands exactly
Huh. I do remember her asking to be her apprentice and shit. Alright. Episode 3. My squeaky little chair. I'm gonna definitely have to buy a new one soon. <laughs> Oh god, a UFO? <laughs> really? So they even have UFOs in their world, what the hell? I like how they just changed the music just to set the tone. <laughs> Randomly. Will you just call them wizards? Warlocks? Pretty sure they're just still wizards. falls in love her magic falls with what oh wow that's highly unfortunate shit you can't love anybody as a witch then feels feels bad mate <laughs> <laughs> True, I was about to say, hold on a second. She's throwing hands pregnant, so you guys still lost? <laughs> well, I'm pretty sure she can relate.
Yeah, hey. You gotta choose happiness over, you know, certain things like that. You gotta choose your own happiness sometimes. I was about to say, hold on. <laughs> Is that her mother? That would be weird. She was thinking something way worse than I know what she was thinking. <laughs> about to say consider she's a reporter probably something around that <laughs> or since she wants to become a reporter she like that Anyway, my mouse pad almost found, almost falls off my desk. God, I'm having a lot. I'm gonna have a lot of editing. I was gonna be another two-hour video. Just because the extra dungeon took way longer than I thought it would. I'm still gonna do that extra dungeon three. Yeah, I'm gonna try that until I finish it. Either that or come back to it. Who knows?
Oh. Okay. Well, that, I guess that explains why she accepted her as an apprentice. Wait, is that the ride there? Why well, you can only get them from through Memento? <laughs> Just that little pun right there. Didn't something happen to Liz? Maybe I'm thinking of a different character. We'll see. But then again, the story was supposed to be without Liz, I'm pretty sure. Alright. Episode 4. Jeez, episode 3 took a while. I'm about to say, with her personality and her wanting to be like a reporter, I doubt she would want to be next on the throne. Wonder will we get like a future version of her, to where she actually is queen at that point. Just how we had like young Cannon and young um, what was his name? Logie's father and stuff like that. I can't remember his name. I haven't even used the character in a while. To be honest, he's decent, but totally just forgot about him.
Oh, they go to mages again. <laughs> of course. Oh, if I know, that's 2019 Oh, okay, I guess, I guess that's fine. Wait, you can teach the monsters how to use magic like that, though? That's the real question. So far, all the monsters I have fought don't use magic like that. I shouldn't say that because then they'll give the devs actual ideas for that, and uh, I don't think I want that. <laughs> I think I would love to avoid that. Oh, is that that thief dude again? Or that bandit dude? Oh, yeah. I like it better with, like, the hood on. Dude, can we just get some units with, like, still hoods? Like, so many units we use without the hoods. And, first off, we did one of it that introduced, like, cannoneers. Or, cannoneers? Yeah, cannoneers. And I actually like the skin for that. Can we have that back? <laughs> We're just, like, one character. Like, I'm a guy who's a fan of robes, but also like hoods. Fair enough. I guess. I mean, she's not doing anything chaotic right now, so you know, I, that I know of.
Oh, her backup was just sitting in the background, <laughs> just waiting for the signal. Alright, last one. Yeah, we're just gonna end it there. Yeah, she changed up from that little stuck-up bridge girl to basically helping your friends at that point. <laughs> Just wonder which kids that would laugh with that fucking really that really annoying laugh from animes. You know, the typical blonde rich girl laugh. <laughs> you guys know what I mean. Wait, where, where did the dude go? <laughs> That's the real question I should be asking here. Oh, there he is. Wait, what did you say? Uh, I missed that last part. Dude, fair enough. Not even gonna lie, he's kind of a badass though. <laughs> even though I'm pretty sure. Wait, no. Never mind, I was thinking of something else. I was gonna say, wasn't he a bug at first? But nah. 
My memory of this whole chapter is just complete shit. <laughs> It's so nice of the council of mages just to sit there and, you know, let them do this. That's so kind and sweet of them. <laughs> oh, goddamn, my camera's moving. Yeah. Nah, fuck it. I'll probably have to just edit it and shit. I'll uh, just leave it how it is. Fuck it. <laughs> Oh wow, she summoned wolves and stuff too. stuff after this? Oh yeah, that was. Totally forgot about that.
Just look at that shock look on her face. <laughs> yeah, why not? Let's have a little bit of competition to where both sides can catch these hands. <laughs> Yeah, sure. That's it. I feel like I just watched a whole Naruto filler. <laughs> uh, okay, that w that definitely wasn't as exciting as I thought it would be. But you know, it's still pretty interesting dialogue in its own way. But eh, just wasn't a huge fan of that one. But yeah, guys, hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys on the next one. Did it? Peace out. So much editing.